Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm your girl, Sincerely KSO. If it is your first time to my channel, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back, my darlings. Thank you so much for coming back to me. We've got a request of reaction, and this was requested by a patron. Hey, honey. <laughs> you requested that you wanted me to watch Jojo Rabbit from 2019. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um... I've never watched this before. It'll be a first time. Before we get into the reaction, please subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell, and remember that if you have any requests, consider becoming a patron to this channel. Depending on the tier that you choose, you get to make one film reaction request every month. The other tiers, you get to participate in our monthly polls. So we have polls every month. The, um, the patrons decide, all the patrons get to put up um, a film reaction that they would like me to watch. The other patrons get to see it and everyone gets to vote. It's open, everyone gets to vote. Whatever comes up top on the likes and um, on the suggestions will be done um, the following month. So it's it's not it's not about me, it's about the patrons, whatever they like, whatever movie suggestions that they like, they just heart it, they like it. The one with the most likes, like I said, will be done. So I hope to see you guys over there. By July, I will be taking the patrons into my kitchen. So we'll be making some really nice, delicious meals once in a while. I really hope you enjoy that. I've got movie reactions, music reactions, and we're adding cooking. So um, I'm excited about that because I want to teach you guys some of my Nigerian recipes. And I hope you enjoy just something different. Like we can eat together, talk together, and, you know, just have a great time. All right. All right. I, I do hope you consider becoming a patron. I'm plugging it. So because it's an amazing platform and it's also a great way to connect with like minded individuals people who like films as much as you do we discuss um frequently so it's it's great it's great all right so jojo rabbit play jojo betzla hmm. 10 years old all my energies and my strength to the savior of our country adolf hitler link and ready to give up my life for him I don't think I can do this. Russ? Okay. Of course you can. Huh? Sure, you little bit squ- Okay. That's the spirit. Okay. Hail me, man. Hail Hitler. What? You can hail me better than that. Hail Hitler. No, just throw it away. Don't even think about it. Hail Hitler. No, you're overthinking it. Hail Hitler. Hail Hitler. Who's Hitler? Do you even speak- Hail Hitler! Hail Hitler! Hail Hitler! Ready for the best week? Wow. Hey, Hitler, guys. Hi, Hitler! You folk! You may call me Captain K. Captain K! Woo! Yeah. He grab us instead of leading my men into battle towards glorious death. Great question. <laughs> no one asked. Perfectly good eye and a totally preventable enemy attack. <laughs> and even though it would appear our country's on the back foot and there really isn't much hope in us winning this war, apparently we're doing just fine. Mm. <laughs> These are very special and expensive weapons. You should never. This is your first step towards being men. Today, you boys will be involved in blowing stuff up. What? The girls will practice important womanly duties. How to get pregnant. Oh. I've had 18 kids for Germany. Oh, my goodness. And the boys were in front, the girls were behind. They were separated. Oh my god! <laughs> is scared. Joker said, 
Jojo said I'm getting out of here. It's in any other race. Now get your things together, kids. So it's face. time to burn some books. Yeah! That is so oh my goodness. What? That is crazy. And they smell like Brussels sprouts. Oh yeah. I forgot about the Brussels sprouts bit. Imagine catching one. First place is reserved for the Führer. So unless you're Hitler, hiding in a fat little boy's body. Put that knife away. When you oh. stand before the enemy, okay. which of you will have the stomach to do this? Good. Did you? <laughs> Army for those that lack strength. We want hardened warriors. Johannes, can you kill? I love killing. <laughs> Come here. What? The boy is frightened. Don't be scared. Come on. He can. Are you scared? I, I'm not scared. I, I just. Kill. Kill. Kill! Kill! Oh! You are a coward, just like oh. your father. He, he's not a coward. You're as scared as a little rabbit. <laughs> Jojo, the rabbit. <laughs> oh, is that how he got his name? Jojo Rabbit. Jojo Rabbit! Jojo Rabbit! Poor oh. Jojo. What's wrong, little man? Don't worry about it. I couldn't care less. But now they call me a scared rabbit. Let them say whatever they want. People used to say a lot of nasty things about me. Oh, this guy's a lunatic. Oh, look at that psycho. <laughs> He's going to get us all killed. <laughs> of course. <laughs> you did it. Faces a dangerous world every day, hunting carrots mm. for his family for his mm. country, rhinoctopuses, even <sighs> the mighty rabbit. Cigarette? <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> Stop. The humble bunny can outwit all of his enemies. He's brave and sneaky. Nobody? Oh, I thought you were crying. Are you a teardrop specialist? Never mind. Jojo, where are you going? So please, little rabbit. Oh. <laughs> to make sure you don't blow your eyes out or something. Oh, All right, yeah. who's uh -huh. first? Mouse! <laughs> Does he know how to do it? Does he know what he's doing? What are you going to do? <laughs> oh my god. Shit. Run. Don't do that. That is so funny. Oh my goodness. I hope he's okay though. Oh my god, look at this karma. Hey kid. <laughs> my darling little cub. Why so happy? Your scars will heal and you'll get most of the movement back in your leg. But I've never been Hitler's personal guards. Ah. Mama Lion worries about her cub, especially when Papa Lion isn't here. Or Inga Lion. Oh. Grab the rabbit by the tail, wrap it around his ear, tie it all up, and then stuff him back down the hole. What? Don't be silly. Of course you do. I look stupid. People will stare. I'm going to pluck up your courage, walk out that door, and have an incredible adventure. 
Okay? Okay. Prepare to leave the house. Is it dangerous? Extremely. Kid, Rob Vesla, you're looking, fetching as usual. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So you are going to look after him while I'm at work? Oh. So, Jojo, I'm sure we can figure out something for you to do. Oh. I did. Also, I think maybe he could hand out this new propaganda. And, oh, yes, that's a wonderful idea. Yes, I give my full permission for you to send this 10-year-old child into war. Or someone <laughs> get this kid a gun. He is a gun. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Is that a gun? No. One moment. <laughs> Take your child away. <laughs> oh my god. Yuck. They hung people. What do they do? What they could. Hey, <laughs> Mama? Bill Marshall Jojo's home. Oh. Ah! oh my god, what is that? There's a person in the room. Far too hungry, and you know how much we love the taste of blood. Lose some. You're not a ghost, Johannes. I'm something worse, but I think you already know that, don't you? You know what I am. Say it! A Jew. Can't be here. Well, your mother invited me, so I suppose that makes me her guest. Of course. Go on then, tell them. You tell her you know about me. Just one word. Got it? Huh? I think I'll hold on to this. It's pretty. Sheesh! That was intense. Hundreds of them living in your walls. <laughs> Hans, and now she's got your fancy knife. Mm, my knife! Yeah. Like Jesse female, Owens. Jewish Jesse Owens. <laughs> do, what to do. Oh, got it! I've but negotiated. Burn down the house and blame Winston Churchill. <laughs> burn down the house and blame Winston Churchill. <laughs> oh my God, boy, what are you doing? You girl on the wall. Mhm. Mm you, you. I'll just say what I have to say. Okay. And that's this. I'm not scared of you, and I think. Not okay. She's pretty rude, you know. That's just my two penny. Yeah, Jew, yeah. Whoa, what are we gonna do about that, Jew? You think of something. Huh. I'm 10. All right, sorry, I'm stressed out. Okay, let's talk like Turkey. Talk like Turkey. See, head. But there's no reason this thing in the attic needs to ruin your life. In fact, you mm. mundo, but the only reason I survived, apart from having bomb-proof legs, is because I had wit by pretending I was dead, I drew out all the traitors. So what are you going to do? 
her feel safe and then she'll drop her guard and then you will be the one in control. Reverse psychology. Don't complicate. Ooh, I gotta go. We're having unicorn for dinner at my place tonight. And don't give her any more knives. Tschüss. Why are you up, huh? Did you eat anything? Hmm? Sorry, I lost track of time. I was taking a long walk and having a think. My goodness. I learned how to tie them eventually, no? I heard her. What? Inya. Her ghost. You've lost your mind. It's sadder for me, though, because I have to live with a crazy person. Honestly, you know what I heard? Rats. Yes, we have them. Can you believe that? Come here all, okay? I don't need you getting sick. Okay, Mama. Are you going to bed, too? Yes, soon. I have to tidy some things first. Mama things. Boy, you have to trust me, okay? I'm the boss here, yeah? Almost. <laughs> Not quite. Great, you got it. <laughs> yeah. If I have to choose between you and my son, I... He can't know. If he knows, then they know. The little boy who, who loves to play and runs to you because he's scared of thunder. In the end, that's all you have. Hope. You've lived more lifetimes than most. I haven't lived at all. If that comes true, then they win. I've been winning so far. They didn't get you yesterday or today. You make tomorrow the same. The son knows. He knows. Oh. You must stretch. Because it will only be a little bit deformed and pointless. I'm going to recommend another month off school. Jojo, maybe I have to go, hmm? Hi, Captain K. Hey, if he doesn't have hand grenade himself. <laughs> How's the leg, kid? I'm being made to teach the HJ boys water warfare training. You know. What should I do if I see one? Uh, okay, if you see a chew, and because these are very paranoid times, probably some other people just in case. It's a pretty drawn out process. It happened to my uncle. A Jew hypnotized him and he became a massive drunk. Related accident, but it was the Jew's fault. Anyway, mm -hmm. did you see one? A Jew? Mm -hmm. So much to write a book on the subject. It would make things so much easier. It'll be a hit. <laughs> Here's the situation. If I tell on you, you'll be in big trouble. And I don't think you want that. And if you tell my mother I know, then she'll kick you out, which you don't want, which I also don't want. So as a Mexican stalemate, yes, tell me everything about the Jewish race. OK. Mm. Please take this seriously. <laughs> think of this as an expose. I want to know all your secrets. He doesn't need it. You know nothing of my sister. Inga and I were friends. I remember you. Obviously, we are demons who love money. Right? Obviously. That stuff will kill us instantly. So, if you're thinking of ending my life, that's the fastest way. Anyway, there's not enough food for you, so I don't know what you're going to do. Your mother managed to find me some bread. Dare you, Jew. You are weak, like an eyelash. <laughs> I am born. My blood is the colour of a pure red rose. Mm. Ooh, like... Break free. Break from descended from those who wrestle angels and kill giants. We were chosen by God. We grow a full moustache. Mm -hmm. Stronger race, huh? So, how's it all going with that Jew thing upstairs? Well, she doesn't want to talk to me. This book is going to be harder to write than I thought. Yeah. Burning. What are you burning? She can't hear you. What are you burning? Why so happy? Things are changing. The Allies have taken Italy, France will be next, and soon... Hate your country that much? I love my country. It's a war I hate. It's pointless and stupid and... And when they are destroyed, we shall use your graves as toilets. Okay, no more politics. Dinner... No, I am not that hungry. 
I might eat later. For now, I'm just going to chew on these grapes. Well, I'm especially hungry tonight. So maybe I'll just finish yours. He doesn't want her to take the food to the girl in the basement, in the attic or somewhere in her closet. So that's what I think. I think that what he's doing, it's not even what I, it's obvious. He is so upset. He's upset with his mom for hiding the Jew upstairs. And she, he's onto her knowing that she's trying to maybe save a meal. They can't afford much. So she's sharing, the mother is sharing what she has with the little girl upstairs. And the boy is trying to eat it all up so that they, the girl could starve. You know what I mean? So um, I like, I like, I know it's a comical representation of what is, what was going on during that regime. And they're, they're maybe trying to explain to younger minds or, you know, people who did it, children who probably don't understand what the whole Hitler, how it was during that period of time and also for foreigners like myself who might only know surface details like seeing that part where people were hung in the street um i don't know if they were because what was written on the man's pants wasn't in english it was um so i don't know if they were jews or they were traitors germans who probably assisted jews to escape germany or you know hide them out um Obviously, that is a, an act that's treasonable and punishable by death in this time. So he's, it's a huge dilemma for him knowing that he loves his mom, but he hates the person upstairs. So he has to be careful as to what he says and what he does. Yeah, um, seeing the invisible friend, you know, his imaginative, imaginary Hitler friend, um, who is encouraging his every whim of hate, but is so ignorant himself and doesn't know how to, is ignorant in so many ways and grossly unaware. I like how they created that character to show how Hitler in certain ways through the movie, in certain ways was not someone who was all there. Who was, and I was literally the early videos that they showed the intro to the movie, seeing people were in awe of him. I remember having this conversation with my mom and she says, every warlord or every, you know, person you think is, was an evil leader, did not start their dictatorship by themselves. They had the support and the admiration of thousands of people because it wasn't just them, it was the ideal that was encouraged and fed by thousands of people in the back. So I've always carried that quote, that saying my mom told me, and it's, it's even to today, anytime I think of a warlord, I'm like, I'm like, you're not even the, you're not the problem. The problem is the support that you're getting. Thousands of people agreed with your vision and that's why it was successful. That's why Hitler is just the name that they're using to front this evil. But remember that there were thousands of people that gave him that power, right? Which is very sad, but it makes you realize that that's where the power comes from. You feed it. You feed it, right? Let's get back to it. If my father were here, he'd get it. Well, he's not. I'm stuck with you. Oh, wow. Stuck with you. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah! Fine. Oh, my gosh. Don't you ever talk to your goddamn mother like that. She shocks you, yeah? Sorry, kid. What? What kind of apology was that? Oh, I see where he gets this. <laughs> see where he gets it from you. 
I'm out there trying to make a difference in the world. And while I'm gone... Oh, gosh. We made a good kid, huh? It reminds me of dancing with Rosie in the red salon. You remember, honey? Oh, my God. The insanity. <laughs> hey. The queen Jew lays the eggs. <laughs> queen Jew lays eggs. Tell me about your family. Lays the eggs. You are not privileged to know about my family. Of course, Yorkie. Yorkie. Amongst others. My fiance. I have him. Where is he? Fighting in the resistance. He proposed to me on the banks of the Fluss. He knelt down like a proper gentleman, recited a poem by Rilke. Who's Rilke? A great poet. Nathan's favorite. Oh, Nathan's favorite, yeah. You turn your back on Germany forever? You turned on me first. Well, we don't need you. Snail, baguette land. No, not just because you don't have a girlfriend. Oh. You'll meet someone and spend your days dreaming of the moment you can hold them in your arms again. Oh. Let's laugh. Ridiculous. Finished. <laughs> He's that ridiculous. Jews live. This is just a stupid picture of my head. Yeah, that's where we live. In your head. Oh. Good one. Good one. Because that's all you think about every day, about Jews. So they live in your head. Yes. Great thinking, Rabbit. We'll use all of these books to make a shmi. Let's get a book and let's go. Libraries are dumb. Really? I have something to tell you. I came across an old letter from Nathan. This is hard for me to say, but I don't want to marry you anymore. Oh. My favorite poet Rilke says, we need in love to practice only this. So goodbye and sorry about letting you go. From Nathan, your ex-fiance. I was lying and unemployed and quite fat now. Don't open the door, but I actually forgot there was a second letter. I changed my mind because I don't want you to kill yourself over me, which a couple of girls have done in the past. Thank God you've been taken care of by that kid, who I must say is a remarkable young man. I let you to get married sometime, even though I am truly unemployed and have nothing going on for me. Beethoven, Einstein, Bach, Gershwin, Brahms. What's your favorite, Rilke? Jewish mother. Dietrich, then. Houdini. <laughs> Stein, Mr. Moses, and the king of them all, Jesus Christi. Amen. Pew, pew, pew. Well, you'll just... If you find any more of those letters, will you let me know? Sure. Okay. time for romance. Someday you'll meet someone special. Why does everyone keep telling me that? Who is the everyone? Who else tells you that? You're stupid. Love is the strongest thing in the world. Besides, I wouldn't even know it if I saw it. Surprise, surprise. No, oh, Cho Cho. You'll know when it happens. You'll feel it. It's yuck. <laughs> yuck. Come on, Schittler. Let's get the move on. Hey, please undo them. No, you're really getting fat. I'm not. You know what? Why don't I just leave you here? Okay. You're growing up too fast. Ten year olds shouldn't be celebrating war and talking politics. It is us, young boys, who will rule the world. <laughs> the Reich is dying. We have to dance to show God we are grateful to be alive. Well. You're free to dance your way home. All right. Oh, no, you don't. No one can stop me.
No news from Nathan today, I'm afraid. He's probably doing something amazing. In the beginning, we used to live in caves. Deep, deep in the center of the earth. Wait, the love of heart. No cutting penises off. Do you want the Circumcision, is that what he's you? talking but about? It's true. After many years of developing Ear magic bugs. and spells, we slowly moved out of the cave. Caves, so, though, in our normal bodies. Which are blobs or something? <laughs> he's looking at her. Where's yours? I'm too young. They grow when you turn 21. Their heads are too thick for us to penetrate. Get them out of here. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Get them out of here! Now! Hiya, kid. I oh, can be happy with you, <laughs> Eat him. Stop it. Walnuts are just walnuts, kids. Like bats. Like That's bats. In fact, did you come by this information? <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, congratulations. What's it called? You who you. It's an what? expose on you. <laughs> uh, it's a bit of a step down from what you're used to, but uh, we need all hands on deck right now. What did she drop? What did she drop on that chair? Was it a letter? Hmm. <laughs> You're a soldier now. At your service. Why he told him Hi. about the girl in oh, the? God, so Is he trustworthy? Is I know it's his best friend, but still, you're not supposed to just tell anyone. He might go back and I tell someone else. I'll just accept. I'll be one of those guys who never get to kiss a girl. Oh, is that what you want? Do you want me to kiss you? Ooh. Okay, uh, I'm massively into swastikas, so I think that's a pretty good sign right there. You're not a Nazi, George. You are not one of them. Yes, you're not. You are okay. not. Yes. To disagree. <laughs> Agree to disagree. Dirty Jew. Well, she called herself a dirty Jew, and he he gave her the bathroom to at least have a a bath. Oh, oh, that's so nice. Oh, he's having butterflies in his stomach. Oh, you guys, he's liking her. God. Uh, Hitler. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Captain oh my Hermann Dietz of the Falcon and Herr Forsch. May we come in? No, my mom is in home. Thank Say you so no. Much. No, Hitler. Heil Hitler. Oh my goodness. Oh, Hitler. Hitler. Did his friend tell him? Tell her? Did his friend go and tell them? You know what I mean? My bicycle got a flat tire, so I carried it. Captain Klensendorf, Heil Hitler. 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 No, no, we were just Heil Hitlering the boy, and then Heil Hitlering yourself, and then, of course, Heil Hitlering Freddie Finkel, and now, now this is my kind of little boy's bedroom. Little boy's bedroom oh. with Hitler posters everywhere. You and your friends may have heard a rumor that Hitler only has one ball. This is nonsense. He has four. Four. I wish more of our young mm. boys had your blind fanaticism. Has she been spending much time at home? Yes. Don't look. Whatever he does, let him not well, look I'm at that wall. I see that you're wearing your... You must always carry your DJ knife. Where is it? I... And who might you be? Well, who might you be? And what are you doing in my house? How is that? Heil Hitler. 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 I did not know you had a sister, Johannes. <laughs> Sometimes you'd prefer if I was dead. Isn't that true? Hideous physical deformity. <laughs> that is a war wound. But, uh... Hideous deformity. Why do you... 
Or what do you have hidden in there? Oh, you know, girl stuff. No. I don't suppose I could see your papers, could I? No, I don't have any papers. Papers, Miss Petzler. Quickly, please. We don't have all day. She's going to look different. How old are you in this photo? First of May, 1929. What is this? I did. It's an expose on juice. How they think, behave, look. <laughs> Guys, you have to see this. <laughs> oh, look at this one. He has a tat. <laughs> <laughs> this one here, it is a drawing of the devil. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's funny because it's true. It's oh, funny look at this it's little true. stupid Jew. Yeah. Nathan being crushed under the wheel of an old time penny farthing bicycle. Who is Nathan, please? Yeah. It reminds oh me, we God, must get back. Remember, because we had that guy hanging oh, up. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for this. You have really made. Hi, 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 Stay home, Jojo. Look after your family. Look after this knife. Oh my gosh, that was intense. That was really intense. Elsa, you fooled them. Hey, seven. First of me, 1929. He was, he was helping you. If they figure out she's dead, then I'll be dead. I'll tell Mama everything when she gets home. That I know you. Man, that was a complete bust. Mind explaining that? Sh she's not. I am beginning to question your loyalty to myself and the party. The German soldier was born out of necessity. German who send their ill-prepared armies clumsily into the lair of the wood. And it is up to you to decide if you want to be remembered or disappear without a... Get your shit together and sort out your priorities. You're 10, Jojo. He's fat in his soup. Oh my goodness. I am so proud of, you know, I'm so proud of the girl. She's just... Jojo, you're such a good boy. Like, I'm so... <sighs> such a good boy. Oh my God, is that your mom? No! No! No, please! No, please! No, please! How could they do this? Oh. No! <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my God. They didn't even let her get home. They didn't let her get home to see her son, you guys. Oh my God. Who's going to provide for them? She didn't tell me much. She said he'll be home as soon as the war's over. She didn't want to tell you anything for obvious reasons. Oh, my goodness, no her shoe. A friend of my father's hid me, and another friend, and friends of friends. My parents went to a place you don't come back from. The gas chambers? Is that where they took them? And everybody's gonna die I think you know the reason why Sometimes But when I have you in my arms, baby Everybody's got a little Yes, they do Everybody try to have a, a good time I think you know the reason why She said if you're with me, I'll never go away That's it because everybody's got to live Before you know the reason why yeah. Okay? Sorry about your mama for agents when I heard what happened. Girlfriend! But you know she's Jewish. <laughs> there wasn't anyone. I heard oh. they eat babies and have sex with dogs. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Englishmen do it too. We have to stop them before they eat us and screw all our dogs. It's crazy. Oh <laughs> They're really on our own. Well, Hitler's gone. Six by everyone's backs. I'm not sure it's just my side. Oh my god. Okay, come here. Okay, see that American there? Just go give him a hug. Go run! Bring to us. Okay. Okay. No. Chocho, no. where's your uniform? No. Die, devil, stop! I think the reason they were using, I, you see, it's symbolic in the sense that not that they were actually young kids, but it's the how gullible a lot of the soldiers who were fighting, they didn't have the facts, you know? Children are easily deceived. And I think it's symbolic of the fact that Jojo and Yogi, it's not like they were kids at war, but probably they were young, but also uninformed as to what they were fighting for. They didn't have the complete information. They only went off what they were being t told, you know, for nation, for country. It's almost like what's going on in Russia and Ukraine. Half the soldiers who are going out to attack these people are unaware. They don't have the details as to what they're fighting. Even the people within Russia don't know what's going on outside because of how oh, the propaganda of it all. It's just... It's so beautiful and sad at the same time, but it's... See the uniform, his guy that he drew. You know, the buildings had eyes. When we saw, not long after we saw the mother die, we looked at all the buildings and it was built in a way where people in the attic, that little window looked like eyes. So what I'm thinking is that all that time the mother was maybe spreading pamphlets. Someone somewhere might have seen, seen her do something and reported her, you know? And just in, a little time later, 
they had killed her. They had, they had killed her before she, she never got to see the victory. Never got to see. Hey! Amos! What? I, I don't understand. Is it the jacket that he's holding on to? That's okay. Hey, a kid. Stelia, my friend, we've come, we've come to the end. The party's over. I'm sorry about Rosie. She was a good person. <laughs> An actual good person. Hey, it's okay, kid. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry for laughing at it. Very creative. Come here, let's take a look at you. Okay. Take off get the away. jackets. Get away, Chu. Hey! Get no, I don't know this dirty Chu. No, that's... No. Get away, hey, Chu. Hey. Shut your mouth, Nancy. He's trying to save her. No. Go home! No. No. Go home! No. You okay? Thank God. I'm gonna go home and see my mother. <laughs> I need to cuddle. Nothing makes sense anymore. So now the war's over, at least your girlfriend will be free. She can leave now. What's going on out there? Georgia, what's going on? Yes, but he's afraid to tell her. He doesn't want to lose her. Georgia, who won, who won the war? She only won the war. I'm, I'm sorry. This is so sad. Like, I can't even... I can't even, it's just so emotional for me. I can't. Hey, your mom. And I know you feel like giving up. But you have to carry on. He's going to help you get out of there. And then you can come live with me in Paris. Are you sure she's still alive? Oh, what if out of depression she killed herself in there? He died last year. Uh -huh. Tuberculosis. So she knew all those letters were fake. I know you think of me as a younger brother, which is fine. And um, you're too old anyway. Where in the shit do you think you're going? Hmm? You're dead. Out. Out? Oh, no, you don't. Yes. You admit it. I just said yes. I knew it. He, didn't, he admitted it. Oh, it's never going to work out. Okay, you're gonna forget about that disgusting Jewy cow up there, and you're gonna come back to me where you belong. Uh, Heil me, Heil me what? for old times' sake. Heil me, little man. Get lost. Okay. No. A little high, just a little. High. Can you push him out Please the window? <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Your mom used to do that all the time. Tie your laces. I'm going to cry. You can do it now by yourself. Yeah. We made it. Probably deserved that. They escaped. All she had to do was step out of the house. What do we do now? You know, the, the escape plan was just a few steps out. Dance? Is she dancing? She said, "What is she doing? She's free dance."
this. Oh. Oh. Obviously, the worst part in this whole thing was the mom seeing the shoes. The boy just came. The best part was her it's dancing. Freedom. Freedom is so precious. So precious. It's so precious. I don't know what to say. I don't, I don't, I don't. I love the symbolism in it. I love the comic relief. I love the comedy. It was the jokes, even the portrayal of Hitler was so, it was enlightening, right? Yes, I laughed, but it's enlightening. Another great moment was when that old soldier just took off his jacket for him and spat on him. After comforting him because no one else had hugged him like comforted him outside the girl no other german as soon as they killed his mom they came to his house searching they didn't even tell him they didn't even tell him and i think those men that came in knew that she had been hung in the square in public and to have that soldier who knew his mom even after the mom had kicked him in the whatever you know Tell him, reassure him that his mother was a good person. Reassure him that she loved him, you know? And he just hugged him. Took off the hat when nobody was watching. The next moment, took off the jacket and said, push them away. He said, you're Jew, stay away from me, stay away from me. To save his life so that he could go. I, I just, I feel pain in my chest. It was just a beautiful movie beautifully done and that boy is such an incredible actor i just love him so much he was the best and he and his friend yogi oh, the best that boy is incredible incredible ah there were so many funny moments and okay i'm done Thank you so much for sending this to me. Don't forget to oh, subscribe. Oh, my heart. Ah. Incredible, incredible movie. Um.